Due to its high efficiency, this method can further advance induced pluripotent stem cells, or iPACs, as a tool for studying human disease and developing novel stem cell therapies. The main advantage of this protocol is the ability to generate high-quality, integration-free iPSCs from primary human fibroblasts, including difficult-to-reprogram, disease-associated, aged, and senescent fibroblasts. The success of this method depends on optimal RNA transfection efficiency of fibroblasts, and adjusting the pH of a transfection buffer is a key procedure to achieve this. To start, prepare transfection buffer by using 500 milliliters and 100 milliliters room temperature pre-warmed bottles of fresh reduced serum medium. Measure the base pH of the medium in 500 milliliter bottle by inserting the pH meter's glass electrode into the buffer and wait up to one minute before reading the pH. To adjust the pH, add three to four milliliters of one molar sodium hydroxide into 500 milliliter bottle. Close the bottle and mix well. After waiting for five minutes, open the bottle and insert the pH meter's electrode into the buffer. Wait until the reading on the pH meter stabilizes. Continue adding small volumes of one molar sodium hydroxide until the pH reaches 8.15 to 8.17, making sure to calibrate the pH meter several times during the process. Use a 0.22 micrometer vacuum filtration system to filter sterilize the transfection buffer. Aliquot the sterilized buffer into 5 milliliter tubes with minimal airspace.